Of course, Hurricane Milton in the path of that storm and then Aaron cooler temperatures as people step out. Yeah, we have a frost advisory in effect tonight for parts of the southern tier, but let me get you updated on Hurricane Milton. If you're just waking up, it is a category one hurricane right now. Winds of 85 miles per hour. The center of circulation is off the east coast of Florida. So it started near Siesta Key yesterday, rolled on shore around 830 p.m. And now it is off the east coast. The center of circulation, the eye of the storm is moving out over the Atlantic. Take a look at the radar. Things are starting to quiet down along the west coast of Florida. Still some heavier rain from Orlando toward Daytona Beach and then back. Uh, notice the center of circulation there off the east coast east of Cape Canaveral. The heaviest rains will be on the northern part of this eye wall coming down from Daytona Beach toward Flagler Beach and up toward the Palm Coast and near St. Augustine. Winds are still strong and a lot of Florida still dealing with tropical storm force winds, but those winds will move out pretty quickly and uh, later this morning things will start to improve and once the sun comes up, we'll really be able to assess the damage across Florida. Check it out. Our local weather, a lot of blue on the screen. That's a frost advisory posted from midnight through 9 a.m. for Cattaraugus County and Allegheny County. That's for tomorrow morning. Right now we look at the uh, satellite. We have mostly cloudy skies to start our day. Skies will clear. We'll have a good deal of sunshine this afternoon, but it is cool. 46 degrees winds out of the northwest at six miles per hour. 47 in Niagara Falls, 41 in Jamestown. Temperatures in the low 50s by noontime. Your high today 55 degrees, becoming mostly sunny. Here's a look at our sky cast. Low 50s by noontime, mid 50s this afternoon with blue skies. Clear and cool tonight. Overnight lows in the 40s, 30s across the southern tier. Then we're back in the 60s for Friday. Friday looks fantastic. Then we head toward the upcoming weekend. Again, Friday looks great. Very early on Saturday, maybe a shower while we're sleeping, but becoming mostly sunny in the afternoon. Sunday, unfortunately, it looks like a rather soggy day with rain showers off and on for the second half of the weekend. Your forecast for today becoming mostly sunny with a high of 55 degrees tonight. Overnight lows in the low 40s with frost across the southern tier tomorrow. Breezy with sunshine mid 60s Saturday becoming mostly sunny near 60 rain on Sunday cooler from Monday.